All right, so we have two different groups that are going to a concert. The adults, we're gonna go ahead and label that with an A, and the children are going to be C. The big piece with this is this first statement that 97 people attended a concert. That gives me my first equation. I know that the number of adults plus the number of children is equal to uh, 97. Now, the next statement I need is the value or the revenue. And the way we get this is by taking the cost of the ticket times the number of adults and then plus the cost of the ticket times the number of children and that is equal to and that is equal to the total that the concert took in which in this case was $2,522 and uh, 50 cents. So this is our how we would write this equation. We would write it out as 32.50 for the adults tickets plus $15 for the children's tickets is equal to $2,522.50. Now we take and we have to use substitution here. I'm gonna take this, the sum of the tickets and I want to solve for A or C. It does not matter which one. Um, so I'm gonna move uh, C to the other side and I get the fact that A is equal to 97 minus C. I'm gonna take that and plug it in for A. And now I have 32.5 times 97 minus C plus 15C is equal to 2522.50. I'll now multiply this out. So I just went through and distributed the $32.50 to both of these pieces. Now you want to go ahead and um, combine our like terms here. So this is a negative 32.5 plus 15, <coughs> which leaves us with a negative 17.5 for C. And I'm just going to go ahead and do this right now. I'm also going to subtract my 3,152.5 from both sides of the equation at the same time equals negative 630. And we divide both sides by 17.5 negative, And we get that the number of children is uh, 36. Now to find the number of adults, we go back into our equation we had in the very beginning of the class, which is a plus c equals 97. So I know I substitute c back inside there, and I get the fact that a is equal to 97 minus 36, or that the number of adults is equal to 61. And those are my two answers. And you'll have to put those in into the appropriate spots into my other math.